Hey, Brian, why is your sister always alone? Is it because she dresses so funny? <laughs> A bunch of love notes from your friends. I'm sorry about that, Melissa. I didn't really know what to say. You ever think about maybe changing the way you dress? And maybe that way people wouldn't make fun of you as much. I shouldn't have to change to make people like me. It's annoying how people like you are so different. Hey, why don't you come watch something with me? You know, like we used to in the old days when we shared a room? I think it's obvious I don't want to watch TV with you. Just leave me alone. What are you talking about? Don't play dumb. Just leave me alone. Brian? Brian? Brian! It took you so long. I couldn't hear you, I'm sorry. Why are you yelling? I don't know. It sounds like there's someone trying to come through the wall. You sound crazy. I think your creepy music's freaking you out. No, I swear, I heard something. Okay, yeah, not funny. I really heard something. I what? heard twice already. Lighten up. It's probably just the neighbors. Calm down. Hello? Hey. Hello? Um, hello? Is there a particular reason for your banging on my wall? I'm sorry, I'm just trying to get your attention. So you decided to hit the wall. What do you even want? Do you like the Smith? What did you just say? Sorry, you probably think I'm just strange. I think it's strange that we're talking through an air vent. What's your Instagram name? We could talk there. Still there? Yeah. It's Melissa. With a three, replacing the E. So long. Talking to your ghost friend? Shut up.
are you so attached to your phone all of a sudden? Why do you care? You just never talk to anyone. It seems kind of off that you are now. So, who are you talking to? My new girlfriend. Okay, sorry. I need to get all sarcastic. Sorry about my friends. Go away. I only talk to ghosts. I'm sorry, alright? I just I told them I thought it was weird how suddenly you had someone to talk to after the night you screamed in your room. You shouldn't have told them. It's none of their business. I'm sorry. So, who is this mysterious person anyway? It's our neighbor. He likes all the bands I like. Happy private school boy in apartment three? No, the neighbor in number five. I didn't know anyone lived in apartment number five. I haven't seen anyone go in or out of that door in months. Yeah, I know. Me either. It's kind of starting to freak me out. What is this? And why do you look so nervous? Can I just have it back? Wait, is this the letter from the neighbor's door? Just give it back. I'm not gonna give it back unless you tell me why you want it so much. He hasn't been replying to my messages. It's been a week. You know that letter's been there for weeks, right? I thought you were just lying about the neighbor to get me to leave you alone. I think you should just leave it alone. You look scared. No one lives next door. What do you mean? The paper on the door was an eviction letter. 
You still haven't heard from this kid? No. And now I have no idea who I've been talking to. The paper was there long before I heard knocking on the wall. Huh. Hey, why are you crying? I thought I finally found someone to talk to. A friend, even. Who have I been talking to? I still don't know who I've been talking to. I know. I'm sorry about the other day. I was mad at someone and I shouldn't have taken it out on you. Do you want to talk about it now? I was upset. Because the person I've been talking to, who I have no idea is, by the way, keeps disappearing on me. I've never had anyone who's shown this much interest in me before. I don't want to lose whoever it is. You were the neighbor? I didn't know how else to talk to you. I thought you hated me. I'm not sure whether I should hug you or punch you. You're not as bad as I thought. <laughs> 